Right, let's get into it. Episode three. Three times speed. Now I have filled in the the river outside of the, the city park here. So it's all scrapped in. Now let's get this path deleted because we no longer need it. So we'll go into here, we'll demolish buildings, we'll demolish down to this little uh, lumberjack flag here. And that means we can plant some more spruces. I mean pines. We can get some more pines planted. Go on, plant those pines. Oh, look at that. All the water's coming back. The scrap's getting mossy. The scrap's getting mossy. <laughs> I want to see if we may as well get you on the go, but we need more water storage. That's what we're waiting for. I need to get these chopped down so we can get something happening. Because I've been thinking. I think these blueberries here are enough blueberries. I think, I think I'm going to uproot these ones. I don't want them. It means I don't have to have a gatherer flag either. Now right, let's uproot these without doing the trees. Then I want to get trees planted in there. I think it's a better use of the space because we don't have much space here in City Park. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, we need to sort that out, but. I had already segued to the city park renaming, so we're going to rename this district from placeholder. Look at that perfect cursor placement. So there we are, city park. Now, oh, yeah, right. We're flooding. Oh, oh no. It's washed out the campfire. No, the campfire's out. That was the only thing the beavers had. They've got no homes. Everything else is flooded. All the beavers had was his campfire in city park, but no. Now they don't even have that. I've got 49 bits of wood, so if I... I'm going to have to strand some beavers temporarily. But if I go ahead and delete this... I was worried about this in an earlier episode, let me get... There you go. There's only three little bits of dam there. And I was worried that it wasn't enough and it was going to overtop. So, if we delete this levy, collect those... The highest of priorities, get those collected, that will solve the flood. I've got two beavers stranded. Is that then picked up now? Alright, now we get a dam on the go. Dam that up, slap a path on it. And uh, we want that to be the highest priority as well. Let's go. And I think I'm going to do the same, the same here as well. Right. Speaking of, let's just get it done. Less thinking, more demolishing. Look at that river raging into the scrap. Yeah, old mate there has just picked up the last log. Oh, what a belter. Let's get this dam in. And let's not forget the path on top. And the priority of the dam. Big priority. Now you two peeps are just going to have to be homeless here tonight. But that's okay because there's no homes over this side of the river either. <laughs> oh, I need to sort that out. I need to get some housing on the go. We've already got 160 signs. We're down one worker altogether and it's this one. That's not the end of the world. I feel like I really, really want some more water storage. Like It is... Something I want. Come on, let's get this, uh, get that dam on. There we go, everyone's connected. You can go. On, oh, very hungry, very thirsty. Well, luckily we have some, uh, some berries in Colorado and some bloody water for you to sip down on. Go on, sip that water, scran that bait, live your best lives. All right, we need to get some more trees planted over here. Just gonna go with the oaks. Just oak it up. The sooner we get these planted, the better. Because they take a bloody while to grow, do they? Don't know why I said do they. The day. 30 days, but you get a lot of logs out of them. 8 logs versus the pines here, which are 12 days for 2 logs. And these birches, which are 9 days for 1 log, they're just, if you're really in a pinch, which kind of arm with 33 wood here. I've been thinking about how to utilise this extra space, this extra block I've got here. Oh, there's a drought. There's a drought. A drought inbound, 3 days, right, pause. I need to have a think, I need to do some things. I need to get some oaks in here. Get those planted. Can you not reach? Yeah, you can reach there, so you should be planting that. Right. And you. I've been teasing this from last time. I might just get these dug up so I can... I really don't know. Are we flooding it? Are we flooding? No. Don't tell me we're flooding. We're flooding. We're flooding. This needs to be redesigned. Oh... What a meh. What an absolute meh. Right, landscaping. 250 science for a double floodgate. And that's what I need. Oh, but I'd need planks as well for that. Oh, what can I do? 
I mean, I, I know what I need to do. It's just a case of I don't have any planks, do I? No. Oh, this is a nightmare, this. What to do, what to do. The campfire is fully under what I knew. This is no good. It's no good at all. Well, I was just about to say, I was thinking about what I can do with this bit of extra space here, and I... I really don't have the wood to do anything, but... Having no planks is the biggest issue, because it's like stairs. I could use stairs to get around, but I need to keep this side of the river here open. I was going to say how much is a bridge, but I can imagine bridges are a bit more expensive. Ooh, I need planks! I need plugs. Ah, oh, how, how far is that drought away? Can can I afford to just let things flood? How bad will the flooding get? Will the flood subside? It's looking all right over here. I, I think I'm just gonna have to play this out. It's just gonna flood and then not flood and flood and not flood. <laughs> oh no! But I really need the wood. This constant flooding and unflooding. I can't be. We can't be doing this. Now. Do I have any storage for food? Just the fifty in there. Oh no, the flooding's sustained and continuous. Somehow this isn't flooded. God knows how. No. <laughs> Look, I, I do know what I could do, but... Pause you, pause you. So we got the beavers over this side. And I'm just, I'm gonna have to do something drastic like that. Just to let the water out. And then hopefully that lets the water out. I'm not overly convinced, considering it's really high, the level over here. I think I might be doing something with all the scrap that I've placed in the river. Maybe it does have an effect on the flow. I might want to just delete these at the end here. I'll make them really small. We'll see how we go. But yeah, the water level's really high here. It shouldn't be this high. Like, yeah, I'll, I'll switch on the, the dev mode here. I'll pause it so I can go in and delete. Just delete these three here. And I'll turn the dev console off when I resume. And we should see that the water level drop. And maybe it needs more than one passage to go down, but we'll see. Yeah, you can see the water level's dropping there. What I'll do, I'll pause it, we'll jump in the dev console again. And I wonder if I could still have ruins there, but just one height. So it's the same as the uh, barriers in front. Because I feel like the barriers are just the, you know, the water source degraded into nothing. You know, it's, it sort of looks similar and stuff. That's how it's set up on the the city park wall here. You know, the ruins are just the, the city around. You know, it's collapsed into the river and whatnot. You know, you can see it's all flooded. I think it looks all right. It's not too bad. Alright, let's get out of dev mode. We've replaced the tall scrap ruins here with the short ones. So it's only as tall as the barriers. Let's get playing. And that should help with the water level. That should drop down back to the level it should be. Because it should be... It should only be here. It should only be at the top of there. It's an extra, like, two blocks. And I suppose, while this is all happening, let's just plunk some storage down. Do I have the space for this anyway? <laughs> nope. What a waste, because I'm going to have to end up redoing those, but... Yeah, get those on. We've got the drought started. I really could have used that extra water. But uh, you know what? That's what happens when you try and be fancy. I put the scrap up in that. So, for over here, I'm thinking... If I do a gatherer flag... Ah, oh, I can't even check, but I'm, I'm sure if I do this gatherer flag here, because this forester planted these two, all of these berries, so I'm pretty sure this will be able to see all of these berries and gather them. And then, I think I need to do a lumberjack flag, but it may have to go... See, I can't do it there, because it won't get this little piece down here. It won't do that one. Plop it so it's in line with that door, and then it's going to have the exact same range as the forester. And then you can be deleted. You can be deleted. And now, let's take the beginning of the episode. We can demolish this path, but we can demolish it all the way down to there. Look at that. Butte. Drying out trees over there. You can reach cotton, yes, right. Just not sure why that's not getting planted when it can reach. <laughs> get the oaks planted. I'm just going to make sure that these get picked up. Berries, not so much. I'll delete those because I don't have any storage for them anyway. Kohlrabi storage. Kohlrabi storage. Go. I wanted to pick up these, essentially. That's all I want. And then I can start doing something over there. And I think the problem with this flooding was this being all backed up with the, the tall scrap metal ruins. So we'll put another dam down on there so we can get across with a path on top. Look at that one berry bush. Yeah, this forester. Yeah, you can see all of those. Perfect. You know what, honestly, I might just leave that rather than faffing about waiting for them to get get round to it. Pick those up, will you? Build those. Oh, and that those logs have been picked up, which means I can delete this path. Plant some more trees. Absolutely beautiful. Nah, it's a lot better than it was at the start of the episode. A lot more efficient. This little tree-grown corner over here. Right, now we've got this. This little area here. 
and I want to try and make some power over here. The water wheel, especially in hard mode when the droughts are just going to get longer and longer, it's 25 wood and it's only going to do 40 horsepower. Power wheel I can use during the drought, you know, slightly more horsepower for double the wood. Ideally I'd like to go for an engine, but I need gears, which I'll, I believe need planks, and then I need sort of metal steel blocks as well. So we're a bit off an engine. And these are, most of these are mods here. The gravity battery isn't, but the geothermal stuff and the vertical power shaft are, are mods. Yeah, I'm committed. I'm letting it play while I do this. <laughs> Man's committed to it. And then for storage. Ah, oh, I still can't fit a medium warehouse on. <laughs> Mate. Alright. We might turn one of these into... Ah, oh, I need to do the different type of storage, don't I? What a nightmare. I may as well have some berry storage as well, why not? Oh, you get resumed. Chop down that birch. Chop the birch. Chop the birch. Oh shit, chop the birch. Look at him chopping away. What a legend. Yeah, you got now to chop, have you, mid? Stay there because one day we'll be coming back for you. Oh, and the campfire's on. Beavers are loving it. Look at that. An absolute full campfire. Fan tabby dozy. Oh, I've got some science now. Now, I was going to use it for floodgates. But with the... Oh yeah, I'm out of logs. The joys. So I'm here. Big chilling. Waiting for trees to grow. <laughs> yeah, waiting for trees to grow and then we'll get the, the industrial lumber mill on the go. These these pines are growing. These oaks are cracking along nicely. And they were somewhat staggered in their planting, so we'll replant these as oaks when they when they grow. I can't wait until you've planted all the trees and you finally get to plant that one. Are you going to go for it next? Where are you going to go for these two? Where is he going to go after these two? Where are you going to go after this oak? Where is he going to go? Come on, Joff. No. Oh, I knew it. I knew he'd go over there. He's going to plant them all except for the one I want. I think there's only two within before he goes to that third one. Oh, no, he's going up these ones now. What a mad lad. All right, so I'm thinking there'll be this one and then they'll plant the one that the oak's blocking and then surely he's going to go about the corner. All right, come on. This is it. This is it. Ten years old, you can get into that corner and plant that tree. He's good, he's good. Yes! That tree's getting planted. You know how long it's been. Ah, there we are. Ah, oh, and they're starting to grow. Go on, get it chopped. Get it chopped, mate. Chop that bloody oak. I have pain, rather. Ah, oh, man. It's happening. It's happening. Whoa, why have we got hungry beavers here? Why do we have hungry beavers? Why are you hungry, mate? Like... There's heaps of bait. Right, get the stairs unlocked and get the platform unlocked. It's like all of that will come in handy, I'm sure. Very shortly when I start doing some vertical building. Right, it's a shame we had a little bit of a water drop there with that, that damn piece being knocked out. A half a block that we didn't get to retain. I'm keen to see what you... You know, let me know what you think of the... the scrap filling the river here. I quite like it. And yeah, let me know what you think of Seti Park. I'll be keen to hear. Oh, we've got two jobs not being fulfilled. I'll tell you what, for now, you can get paused. Because there's berries going on over here and people sitting on their arse because we've got full storage anyway. I'm going to leave these as pines for now just so we get a bit of a quicker grow. Because they are growing over twice as fast as these oaks. And we're going to need some sort of supply of wood otherwise we're just going to be sitting at stalemates like this the whole time. There's no trees over here that need to be chopped down. And I think I might... Don't plant there. Don't plant over here. See, it was weird. My whole plan with this farmhouse here was to was to plant over here but now this is tree growing area we'll see how that goes for now because it's a fairly you know fairly large area for the one to, to keep on top of and we've we've got full storage and on food and everything i'm consistently one beaver short and we're going to introduce a handful of new jobs so i'm going to unpause that breeding pod we'll get my population climbing oh i'm still on speed too either one that's so slow hey lumber mills lumber mills up and running any planks that uh, any logs that come in get them turned into planks. I need to, yeah, I need more beavers because now I don't think any of these are working. Oh. We definitely need at least, like it's a pairing, we need both of these operating. <laughs> we had two people sitting on the arse day and now in the industrial lumber mill. And one of them, yeah, one of them went next door and started, now I'll do the power. All right, so we're starting to get planks. We're gonna have to stall them somewhere. Or build. Should we build? Yeah, we'll build. So do I want triple floodgates here? I want quadruple, enough floodgates, I want quadruple platforms, right. And what I'm trying to think is what I'm going to do about water and things like that. So I think those two water pumpers are quite good there. I might plop another two there so we got four. So if I come out 
like that. And then I want to do a bit of housing, a bit of this, that and the other, you know. And I remember in the first episode I was looking at the barrack and I was like, that fits quite nicely there. And my plan was spin it around, have the path coming off and have it supported on the back there. Ah, it's after some deliberation. I decided we're going to have it coming out the side there because it uh, lines up perfectly. If I plop a path in here, it will connect perfectly onto that path. So happy days with that. And then, you know what, for my next grand master plan, I think I might have to just uh, go ahead and wait until the next episode, eh? I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, definitely smash the like button. If you didn't, leave a comment and tell us why. I've got another drought. What? I've got another drought? In three days? What a bear. Well, you get to save me master plan and another drought in the next episode. Peace.